Alright guys, so then I'm going to show you my Resident Evil collection. There's seven to go through. I'm going to go through all of them, get to all of them. And before I start, I'm only talking about the movies. I'm not going to talk about any of the video games. So um, let's start. So we'll start in 2002. We had Resident Evil, Miller Joe Voyage, Michelle Rodriguez. Evil Never Dies is 15. It's 2002. There is Side. There's a back. Brilliant and Brutal. Prescription Special Features. It's on for 97 minutes. It's 15. So you in person with another copy spot in person of age. There's the disc. So, um, this one's okay. Um, I don't think any of them are good. I think this is probably the best one. But, um, so if you're this series, I recommend you start this one. So it's Resident Evil. Then in 2004, we had Resident Evil Apocalypse, Miller Jovovich. It's featuring exclusive material from Resident Evil Extinction and brand new special features. Resurrected Edition is 15. It's came 2004. Aside. There's about Prisco and Special Features. So for 1 hour 32 minutes. It's a 15 contains constant right of violence and strong language. It's a disc. So this one's just okay. It's just apocalypse. So in 2007 we had Resident Evil Extinction. Miller Joe Witch. A rock and roll ride of a blockbuster. 4 star. It's a 15. It's Kim Town 7. There is a side. There's a back, prescription, special features. It's on for one hour, 30 minutes. It's 15. They strong body violence. It's a disc. This one's also okay as well. So that's Resident Evil Extinction. In 2010, we had Resident Evil Afterlife. Miller Jovovich. The best Resident Evil sequel yet. It's 15. Side. Back, pulse pounding entertainment. Prescription, special features. Is on for one hour five for minutes. It's fifteen ten strong bloody violence and language. It's disc. The uh, this one's probably it's not that great. So it's after life. Uh, then in 2012 we had Resident Evil Retribution, Miller Jova Witch, the biggest and best Resident Evil yet. It's fifteen. Side. But humanity's lost then. Prescription special features. So for one hour thirty two minutes. It's fifteen ten strong bloody violence. You flip back and ultraviolet. And there's a disc. This one wasn't great either. And then um then in 2017 we had Resident Evil, the final chapter. And that is the last one of the original series. Um, the most successful video game based franchise ever is 15. It's gonna turn 7, 17, side. Back prescription special features of one or forty two minutes. It's fifteen strong bloody violence. There's two discs. There's this one. There's this two bonus discs. So get a lot of special features. So uh, this one wasn't great. Um, yeah. So this is the finale of the original one. So yeah, that's the final chapter. And finally, twenty twenty one, we had Resident Evil Raccoon City. This was kind of like a reboot. It starred new actors. And I just saw one, by the way. Um, Witness the beginning of evil. It's 15. It's fine. Back. One of the best films in the entire Resident Evil franchise. Fun, frantic, frightening in the best way. Um, it's on for one halfway three minutes. It's 15. Sean Bloody Vines. Go horror language. And there's a disc. And this is the first one to have the new BBFC 15 rating. So, yeah. Um, this one's a reboot. Uh, this one was okay. And uh, so yeah, it's Resident Evil franchise. Um, there was a TV series in Netflix one, which was on, ran for one season. They got cancelled. But um, there's Resident Evil collection. Um, I know people don't like this franchise. Like it's, it has really nothing to do with the games. Um, um, the main character Alice isn't even in the games. They made her for the film. So uh, comment down below. Let me know what's your favorite Resident Evil movie. My favorite is the first one. Guys, so much for my video. I'll see you next time. Bye.